And your host from this evening, it's Eddie Malaki! Thank you all for coming. Um, what a lovely audience we have in. A lot of lovely couples hanging around here. I have a girlfriend, yeah, and uh, my... I, sorry, yeah, not tonight, okay. Uh, <laughs> my girlfriend is Spanish, you know. I, thank God for the EU, am I right? Okay, we're never leaving the EU, okay? Uh, but the Spanish, they're a very expressive people emotionally. You know, the Irish, like, I, I bottle things in a lot, but the Spanish, whatever they feel, you see it on their face straight away. If a Spanish person gets angry at you, they get very angry for 20 minutes, and then it's just over, like, healthy. But if an Irish person gets angry at you, they just get a tiny bit angry for 20 years. <laughs> I won't forget that now, you bollocks, yeah. Anyway, good to see you. I'll see you later. You're off. Yeah, 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 you fucking bollocks. We don't forget, you know, um, but the Spanish expressiveness is great for dirty talk because you know what the person is feeling. Like, it's clear. Spanish dirty talk. Hey, I like to do some strange things to you. Eh? I like to do dirty things. Like, we know what the context is. An Irish man saying those same words, though. Oh, how are you? I'd like to do some strange things to you. <laughs> I like to do dirty things. <laughs> he has asthma as well. <sighs> it's true, Irish, we're just too awkward for dirty talk. Right? Where I'm from, Galway, you'd be riding a, a lovely Galway girl, right? Yeah. Who's your daddy? Huh? Who's your daddy? James Murphy, do you know him? He's a carpenter by trade. <gasps> Is that the Murphys from Bridge Street? Ah, you're a dirty girl. I know your family. You're a dirty... <laughs> Why are you shaped like a microphone stand? What's going on? <laughs> Spanish are very, very expressive people. It's great. And I was in uh, Spain for a lot of the summer and they dub everything on TV. They don't do subtitles. And the Spanish voiceover actors, I don't know what cocaine they're giving these people. <laughs> Way over the top. I was watching a Billy Bob Thornton movie. Do you know Billy Bob, great deadpan actor? Billy Bob's line in the movie was, if you fight with monsters for long enough, you become a monster. The Spanish voiceover actor decides to go, que combates a este monstruos, que rosa a tu. It's like, fuck me, Billy Bob's not gonna be happy about this, what's going on? So many movies, once they get translated, you know, like uh, James Bond in Spanish. Bonkers. <laughs> the name's Bond. James Bond. Me llamo Bande. Jaime Bande! <laughs> Por favor, shaken no stir. <laughs> and my personal favorite, Star Wars, Darth Vader. Luke! Yo soy de padre! So with no segue at all, I love the Belfast accent. Um, <laughs> Belfast accent is, is my favorite Irish accent. There's a lot of dodgy Irish. Like the, the Cork accent, ooh. Like, the people are lovely, but they sound so sarcastic, you know? Yeah. That upward inflection at the end of every sentence. I went to my granduncle's funeral in Cork and everyone kept coming up, I'm so sorry for your loss. <laughs> no, you're not, you sarcastic prick, no. He's gone to a better place. Yeah, he's not in Cork, yeah. <laughs> Oh, but the Belfast accent, I, my mom got me this audio book of uh, positive affirmations. And, uh, the, but the man reading the affirmations is from Belfast. The Belfast accent really changes an affirmation. Uh, I will achieve my dreams. No matter who gets in my way. Yes, Jerry, yes, that's the stuff I need, Jerry. Thank you. You made my day, Jerry. 
I swear to never plant a car bomb again. <laughs> Unless I know he's driving it, okay. 